cyborgs are a hybrid of humans and machines. Are they applicable in reality or only in movies? In the movies, the cyborgs are seen and function as people with their own emotions and desires. The primary challenge in developing cyborgs stems from the need to simulate the human body's physiology, behavior and emotions into mathematical formulas. Renowned mathematician Alan Turing first published in 1950 a philosophical test designed to distinguish between human and machine. Since then, many more tests with similar principles have been created. In recent decades, artificial intelligence technology has evolved, so the original question of whether machines are capable of thinking has become more profound. Do machines have built-in self-thinking capabilities? Can they receive and express emotions? Our body never functions randomly. Therefore, our memories, physiology, emotions, and behavior is consequential and can be mathematically simulated. The biggest obstacle is the mathematical decipherment of the processes in the human brain. Although it is not romantic, concepts like beauty and love, positive and negative emotions, memories can have mathematical expressions. The branch of biomathematics is in its infancy. Still, without a mathematical translation of all human activities, it would be challenging to produce an intelligent cyborg that functions as a human being. Precise simulation of all human body physiology, behavior, and emotions can open new unbelievable horizons. The subject I have presented is just one of very profound philosophical debates, consciousness and memories. Do we have free will? Can we live in a computer simulation? Many scientists today believe that the feasibility of developing human cyborgs is only a matter of time, so the answer is that the movies probably foresaw the future. Thank you for watching this video.